Yeah, how you doing? This is Philip Porter. So the way I got in, so the way that I ended up getting into film heavily. Well, first, um, I had recently moved back to North Carolina. I was around 2008, I want to say. Me and my friend uh, K Dot, um, he had a studio in his house. I was looking for an outlet, some uh, creative outlet. So, so we used to record music, and um, and the music uh, was pretty good. It was pretty good stuff. It was really good quality. So, you know, everybody was always kind of like, you know, we should pursue it, we should do more. And so, quite naturally, then the progression went from, you know, just what we call laying music on wax or recording the music and, um, you know, letting people hear it to wanting to have visuals. So we decided to do a video. And so uh, K-Dot uh, put me on to this kid that he knew that uh, went to the university and um, he shot video. Uh, so I was like, yeah, cool. I'm with it. You know, we spoke to we spoke to the kid. You know, uh, we set a time and date. He came through. You know, he shot the video. Boom, boom. I'm excited. I'm like, oh, man, this is going to be crazy. He came and brought all this equipment. And I was, I was so excited. Like, it was crazy. Like, I was like, oh, man, this is about to be dope. This is going to be crazy. And, um, you know, it was really unorganized. It was crazy. You know, we didn't have any type of treatment or situation we basically shot it in my man's crib and, uh, so we kind of just winged it after the shoot everything was cool you know the kid he gave us a certain time frame that he probably had a video ready and all of that and um so uh you know some time went by my man kid out calls me one day he's like he's like yo phil come through man my man came through with the video so come check it out so i go over to k dot's crib we watch the video it was trash. So, it just motivated me. I, I watched the video. So, in my mind, when we sh when we got ready to shoot the video, I already had a video in my mind of what I wanted the visuals for this song to look like. So, so I tell Kid, I'm like, man, I could shoot a better video. We cannot put this out. And he's like, all right. I didn't have a camera at the time, so what I ended up doing is going to Best Buy, trying to find something uh, to shoot these videos with and um, so my um, the guy at Best Buy he he puts me onto these 720p flip cams so uh, I got the 720p cam because I couldn't afford to get a DSLR at the time and um, we planned it we, sh we did a treatment for the video uh, we found like two or three different locations and we went and shot the video um, and uh, you know we set a date and everything we shot the video and when we debuted the video, like, everybody loved the video. Like, it was just crazy. Like, the, the response we got for the video, uh, it really represented, like, what we wanted wanted it to represent as far as the song is concerned. So, and the video came out, like, crazy. And um, everybody loved the video. And so, it kind of, like, blew up. For me, uh, the local scene is a lot of artists where I am. And um, so, you know, everybody's asking me to shoot their videos. And I, got and I just found, I just figured out that it was something I was really good at and something I really love to do. Like, yeah, so that's how it ended up happening. It was just kind of like, uh, you know, the guy shot a video for us and, you know, I didn't feel like it, it It was like up to par. So I ended up trying, you know, feeling like I could do it myself. And sure enough, I did it. And um, to this day, I have uh, plenty of videos. And, uh, you know, everybody's been pretty happy with with the work. So um, keep going.